good kitten internet let's go ahead and get back to the game um so i'm done with the snow part but i'm still recording at 1440p60 for some weird reason uh it's mostly because that's what i feel like doing so where were we oh should do my now standard stand up and show my shirt it says nothing says love like a cat hug i've had all three of my cats hug me today so if you see a bunch of hair on my shirt that's because there's a bunch of cat hair on my shirt so um what in the world was i doing <laughs> i swear this is going to be the start of almost every episode that's not just me recording one after another after another for reference today is thursday october 25th for me all right so we've got that obnoxious quest We've got um, Temple of the Moon, which I can't do this month anymore, and I'm kind of upset about it. Uh, it's going to have to be 15th, I think, of next month. 14th, 15th, something like that. Um, let's see. Uh, Monolith and Warlord are both in Silver Cove. Blackshire, Blackshire. Creekspire. Darkmoor everywhere okay so it looks like either i'm going to the silver cove yeah i'm just gonna go to silver cove let's let's go to silver cove oh first oh, am i did i empty out my inventory last time i did thank you me from the past you're being extraordinarily kind to me right now so let's go ahead and recast things Action. Our power. And town portal, Silver Cove, let's go. Uh, I assume he's crying because, of course, he is. How am I doing on fly duration? Four hours, I'm fine. So. There's two areas I want to go to here. <coughs> Sorry, my throat's a little scratchy today. I've been having some various issues today, mostly because while I was taking a shower earlier, I accidentally ended up shoving moisturizing soap up my nose. It's great. These are the types of things that you kind of just get used to when you're me, just doing weird things like that. Anyway, I'm just ignoring the those goobers. So we are in the Warlord's Fortress. So as a reminder, this is the Knight or Cavalier promotion quest. So the second Knight promotion quest. And the objective here is to defeat the Warlord and bring back evidence, basically. Oh, I've forgotten how much fun this game is when you're this high. Uh, this outmatching everybody. Now, what I don't remember is what is it about this section that it's telling me there's something weird here? Oh. Getting pulled through the door. That's what it was. So this is basically a small little maze area, but it's basically the start of the dungeon. It's a nice little puzzle. Red liquid, empty, blue liquid. Red, blue, white. really don't understand where that accent is coming from. I actually don't know who any of the voice actors are for this game. Yeah, that is enchantable. That is definitely not. Hardly even worth carrying. Alright, yellow, blue, and blue? Yep. 
Uh, how am I doing on accuracy for people? Accuracy, 87, 60, 54, 26. Well, I know who's getting the accuracy. Okay, and back here is empty. That is enchantable at the very least. That's not. That's all bait at least. Okay, so, um, how are you? Is there anything else back here? I don't think there was, but having that glow is throwing me off. Ah, right, this is just the end of the stairwell. Okay, and this is the fake door. So, anyway, um, how are you? I've been catching up on YouTube. I actually have a video paused off to my right. I've been watching Between the Sheets. Um, <sighs> watching everybody's backstories from Critical Role. How am I doing on haste? 35 minutes, I'm fine for now. Um, so yeah, um, I haven't really mentioned this in any of the videos, but I watch, I started watching, um, I think it's called, what is the phrasing for it now? Um, it's pre-recorded role-playing, um, uh, a bit edited. I started watching um, Ashes of Volcana. Uh, what's the actual name of it now? Um, Bill Wheaton's role-playing series on Geek and Sundry. And I eventually was pointed toward Critical Role, started watching lots of Critical Role. And oddly enough, even though I'm still a huge fan of Critical Role, that's actually not the series that I watch. I primarily watch a series called Callisto 6. Uh, it's not free to watch on YouTube or anything, unlike Critical Role, which is quite unfortunate, actually, because Callisto 6 is so good. Um, I first started watching um, Shield of Tomorrow. I didn't watch it from the start. I picked it up roughly at about two-thirds in and kind of fell in love with it. Um, I absolutely love the series. I am unable to pick the lock. Which means that it's a locked chest. This has a lot of money in it. That's enchantable. That's a really nice amulet. I'm just going to keep that. Enchantable. Not quite enchantable, but close. Also, it's not trapped. Weird. What am I doing for amulets? Regen HP. Okay, it's going to go to my Knigget. There we go. Um, anyway, I really like the cast. They're, uh, how to put it, that's a really nice bow. You'll redistribute that later. Um, the cast is, best way I could, oh crap, best way I could describe it is that the cast doesn't look like me. Um, let me pause that comment for a moment. This is a Kizan art. Um, these are the Death Knight class enemies. They are very powerful. Yes, Boo. Boo Kitties went out and about. Um, while I was testing the audio quality earlier, I ended up talking a bit with Boo. So you'll notice how little damage I'm doing to the Kizan arts. That's because, one, they're resistant to practically everything, and two, they're very nasty enemies. They have a lot of hit points. That's one hit on the Death Knight. Well, one hit plus the two Prismatic Lights. That's how much damage I've done to the Kizanart. That's right next to it. It's kind of ridiculous. This is the reason why this dungeon is so difficult. It's because these, these monsters are really obnoxious. They also cast spells, because why not? Okay. 
I okay, I do have fire blast on. They're not quite at a great melee range. Are you immune to acid? No, good. Um, I do have shrap metal. I'm probably gonna end up casting okay. that. You don't have poison spray on ready. Now you do. Oh, you broke my bow. You mini heads. Now, see how much more damage I'm doing just from those style of spells? And I am hitting other things as well. It's just really hard to tell because of how close I am to things. And you are now afraid. Great. You can tell from the fact that I did one point of damage with one of those fire blasts that Kings and Hearts have a lot of resistances. Hold on a moment. Do I actually have that in my FAQ? <laughs> oh. So I'm actually one of the FAQ writers for Might Magic 6. Uh, I have a basics guide, and do I have a monster list for Might Magic 6? I don't. That must be 7 and 8 that I have the monster list for. Anyway, um, oops. I meant to spell cast, not attack. Also, let's just remove your fear. Oddly enough, I'm actually doing poor damage in melee. That's kind of backwards. Oh, you broke a bow. As good as new. You know what? Take the extra armor. Oh, damn it, did it again. Shrap metal's really the way that you're supposed, uh, well, not supposed to, quote unquote, but shrap metal's the primary way that I end up handling keys and arts usually. They're worth a lot of money and they usually drop really nice things like this plate mail here. It's way better than my plate mail of regeneration. Look at the armor difference alone. This is armor 20. This is armor 54. Um... This is a masterwork armor. This is actually the highest level of plate armor in the game for non-artifact relic type. So I'm just going to equip this right now. But keys and arts are really nice loot. This is actually a dungeon that I frequently go back to if I'm playing long enough where the game resets. Unfortunately, I'm taking a lot of damage. Even the lower level ones are giving me, you know, Double plus the amount of... Oh, I'm not quite close enough to you. I'm still not high enough level in dark to use shrap metal appropriately, I think. So I'm going to switch over to using curative spells instead. Okay. Um, poison spray looks like it works great. I'm going to switch from Fire Blast to Sparks because I have a hunch that this actually does more damage. Which is sad. And you are just frightened. Okay. Um, we're at the point of the game where more and more enemies are resistant and immune to fire magic on top of magic magic. Um, this is where I get in my normal tirade about... The game tells you that there's very little in the game that resists poison and fire, and in reality, I've looked through the files of the game, there's far more in the game that resists magic than anything else. Second is poison, third is fire, if I remember correctly. Just look at how much gold I'm getting from these, these things. I move back slightly. Ooh. You're a herd a lot more than I was hoping. Um, I'm actually going to cast Shared Life. So Shared Life takes everybody's hit points, divides them by four, and gives everybody that many hit points. So you'll look and see that everybody has 220 hit points. It also adds a little bit, which is the reason why if you have high enough level of spirit magic, Shared Life is actually better healing than Power Cure and costs less. 
The problem is that there's no reason to throw that many points in spirit magic otherwise. So, I've run a game before where all I've done is throw things into shared life. What is a boo kitty? Uh, uh, yeah, I'm actually better at meleeing the smaller ones. <coughs> well, it's good to know. So, let's... Find out what's behind this room. I believe it's... Okay, there is a Death Knight in here. I wasn't sure if there was going to be one or not. Meow. Why don't you come up here, Boo Kitty? I'm sure the people in YouTube land would love to watch you. No, I don't mean walk up behind the monitor. Ah. <sighs> Boo Kitty, what are you doing? Why don't you come over here, Boo? Everybody loves watching the Boo Kitty. She's right next to the microphone, so I apologize if she's making noises. Oh, I was not paying attention to haste. Again. My usual. Cure weakness. Night. What are you doing, Boo? I really don't know what she's doing right now. You should actually cure weakness yourself first, I forgot. Buki, come over here, please. There we go. See, there's a Buki. She doesn't like being picked up as much as my other cats. I have to be a little more careful. She's... My dad probably never really picked her up, and that's the reason why she's a little uncomfortable with being picked up. It's a guess. I have no idea. The first time I met Boo was when I went down to South Florida after my father died. So, I don't actually know. Um, your weakness, him. Unable to pick the lock, unable to pick the lock. And money. I will have to come back for those later. Um, might not be a bad idea for me to town portal and heal up now that I'm looking. So, you are the one that I have set for Lloyd's Beacon. Town portal, Serpical. You're the one that I beaconed. Recall, Warlord's Fortress. All right, um, so yes, the time that's underneath is indicative of how long the spell lasts. I'm going to just recast regular haste at this point. Hi. Fist? Yeah, it actually does damage. I'm kind of shocked. Arrow. Uh, let's see. Ice Bolt, do you do more damage? No. You are definitely resistant to ice. Um, implosion? Implosion is usually a decent spell. Go with more Flying Fist. Flying Fist is actually doing a lot. I wonder if they're just not... I wonder if they're actually weak against magic. Well, there's nothing in this game that's quote-unquote weak against magic. It's more that they have less resistance. Or it might be that I'm just rolling well. One of the two. Um, which means... Slow. Now I'm just trying things. Shrinking ray? Mm. 
I really want to see Shrinking Ray actually work for once. I don't think I've ever seen it do anything. And I keep forgetting to cast spells. Shrinking Ray? It worked! You're so tiny! You're a cute little cuisine, aren't you? Yes, you are! Yes, you are! It even makes pitched up sound effects. You know what, you're actually doing less damage, so I should pay attention to you guys. Yet yeah, you can still cast status effects. I mind, remove fear you. I think it is actually doing less damage. Oh, that was an adorable. And you still have just as much loot. That's good. Alright, these are the areas that I know are trapped. But I think I might actually need a key for everything. I have found two keys. It's in a chest of drawers. Not that key. This one is definitely trapped. Discharge papers. Kirkmon, you lack the skill in arms, the dedication, and more importantly, the ability to command to succeed as a knight. Your constant failures leave me no choice but discharge you from the Knights of Enroth. I would suggest you find a new profession, as you would you will never master the arts of warfare. Osric Temper. So, what actually has happened is that the Warlord is actually a knight that Osric Temper actually discharged. That's technically all you need for this dungeon. That's totally enchantable. That's not. Um, technically, we can just leave right now if we want. Uh, I'm not going to do that. I'm just checking to see if these are... Yeah, I thought that was a different lock. Anyway... We're going to finish this dungeon, because this dungeon has a lot of really good loot. I don't think I can open this door. Yeah, this door is double locked. Right, I need both keys to open that door. That's the treasure room, basically. Once more, always explore the open areas before you go after the closed ones, because things like this happen. Isn't it fun how soldiers are no longer that concerning to me? Uh, by the way, how am I doing on haste? 50 minutes. I'm fine, actually. You shouldn't be attacking that. I suppose a power cure is in order. You broke Mordred. And my axe of recovery. And my axe of recovery. So, if I remember it, afraid is decrease accuracy, increase speed. Which is why she's going so often right now. And her accuracy is actually not that bad normally. So, it's only minus two off of what it would be normally. For, or, so, that's intellect. That's right, intellect also drops. Her accuracy is still not very far off of her normal. And still significantly above. Alright, remove fear, you. Now she's back to being smart again and having really good accuracy. Uh, you know what? I'm actually going to swap Mordred back over because she can use some hit points. And he's doubly feared, which I don't even think that does anything, does it? Yeah, there's no difference. Remove fear, you. And now you're afraid. Ugh. There's two keys and arts in there. I'm going to lure them back a bit. Hopefully to split them apart slightly. 
and I will be failing to split them apart because they both followed me. All right, you need shared life. Then power cure. Then power cure. Then remove your fear. So um, I was talking about some of the live role play that I watch, which would be um, Callista 6 at this point is the one that I make sure I'm constantly up to date on because it's so good. All the actors there are excellent. They're so they are still all actors, but they're much more like my D and D groups than they and then say the Critical Role cast. The Critical Role caster, they seem professional, basically. For lack of a better way of phrasing it. Why can I not hit Broadside of Barn? You didn't have your weapons break or anything, right? No. Maybe I should just hold down the A and go. So I think I'm actually doing more damage this way. Very least, real time, it's faster. Oof. I need to heal you badly. My kingdom for better healing spells. These aren't dead. How am I doing on haste? 32 minutes. I'm fine for this combat. I'm going to try to remember to recast it after this combat, though. Uh, nobody's hurt. I'm more impressed that I'm not taking anywhere near that much damage, because this is usually a very, very harrowing experience. Um, usually when I come through here, I have to run from keys and arts and kite them throughout the place. Oh, there's a third key? No, okay, that's the same keys and art. I know there's another enemy there, but it's not a keys and art. Um, you are very pretty plate mail, but not enchantable. I don't have another place to put it. Oh, well. Yeah, you're just a death knight. You're not scary. Okay. Now let's head back. Which there's still one enemy over here, and I think it's running from me? No, it's running toward me. I'm still good on haste. So basically, keys and arts are the source of me actually getting good armor in the game for a while. I wish they would have dropped some unenchanted armor, but the enchantments they gave were really nice, so I shouldn't complain too much. Power cure, quick save, recast haste. I remembered this time. These are all dead ends. Well, not dead ends. There's doors. I just mean they're not open. Ugh. think I'll be okay just attacking. Um, do you all end up watching any live RPGs? 
Okay, it looks like it's just mine. Oh, hi, Boo. Nope, nope. I don't want you going back there right now. I haven't hung my um, mount. I received my mount today from uh, Amazon. Let me move my video card over and show the mount off. This is the mount I'm hoping will actually... It's upside down. This is the mount I'm hoping will hold my monitors. Um, top one, this part of the mount is going to hold the smaller monitor. This bottom one is going to hold the larger monitor and has a clamp. And this clamp should be deep enough. Yeah, should be deep enough to go past the bezel, assuming that I measured correctly. Which means that this will actually work really nicely. Ugh. Sorry, this thing's really heavy. Um, that's what I'll be installing this weekend. Because I have to pull my desk out, I think, to do this. Um, and it's really heavy, so I want to make sure I have somebody else with me. Um, I'm going to transfer Mordred back. Power cure. My kingdom for better healing spells. Mm. I'm not dead yet. That's my last power cure without having to use an item, which I'm probably going to be using an item. How are you on spell points? You have nine. I think that's one more cure wounds, because I think cure wounds give cost five. Yeah, I don't think Sparks is worth casting. I think her normal attack might be doing more. Cure wounds yourself, and then you'll remove fear, and that will be about it. Cure Fear is going to cost one, or two. Please just die. Stop dodging my attacks, thank you. And they're now in the way. It's time to start using these. See, even 100 spell points only gives that much of the bar. His maximum spell points are 485. It's a, a, right about a fifth of their maximum spell points. get off. I think Power Cure actually heals more. 10 plus 2 per 5. Oh, it only heals 5 more. That's not a big deal. There we go. And you are now dead. No whammies. Oh, I was hoping for plate mail. Power Cure. And time to loot. Unable to pick the lock. Uh -huh. That's totally enchantable. Yes. That's fairly nice for a helm. Ew. That's salvate. And there's the other key. So I believe now I can open or not. Is there three keys in this dungeon? I want to say there's three keys in this dungeon. Who else has a key? Actually, I'm going to give the keys to her because, okay, yeah, there's another key in this dungeon. Money, 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 money. Yes. Alicorn Wand of Ice Blast. That's enchantable. I'm going to have to rearrange. That's a really nice ring. Okay, let's rearrange some stuff. So Might plus 15. I'm bound to have a ring that's worse than that. At the very least... Yep, this ring is going to go. This ring is staying. I'll put that up for redistribution. 
This is not worth carrying. Let's dump some of the things not worth carrying at this point. I was about to say, I can make that fit. I just want to rearrange this slightly better. There we go. Okay, um, continuing on. Okay, the rest of my hour of power will expire first. What's in here? Beyond more enemies, of course, because there's more enemies everywhere. Uh, another keys in Crap. Okay. Oh, derp. I'm going to drop a beacon and TP out of here so I can heal. Let's go ahead and, boy, I wish remove fear existed in reality. That would be so much easier. I'm gonna recast Hour of Power. I meant to do that before. I'm just gonna recast all of these. So these spells don't look like they're doing a whole bunch right now because they're not. Um, it's because eventually they will be doing way more than their fair share of buff um beacon recall warlord's fortress by the way whenever you recall and go back into a dungeon everybody resets to where they were so this is technically a way to actually um jump past enemies basically Sadly, this is more efficient than me casting my spells at the moment. I need better magic. Well, it doesn't help that these enemies in particular are very resistant to magic. I mean, the Doom Knight I could probably take on with that. Same with the Death Knight. But the Kisenard is so resistant to everything that it's just not worth it. Remove fear is such a slow spell. Um, shrink? Oh. Yeah, he's the only one with shrink ray. Shrink? There we go. Get rid of the others first. Ugh. I have no area of effect status removal. There's only one in the entire game. And it's this one here. Um, mind, remove fear, her. Ugh. Are you freaking kidding me? That is a very nice set of plate mail. Also, why do I keep forgetting to sell things in town when I'm there? Should have been more impressive than it was. Bolt. There we go. All right, and what do you have? Money. But that's worth a lot more money. That is 14,000 gold pieces. That's enchantable. But I don't have a spot for it at all. Yeah, I can make that fit. Because that's, yeah, that's already enchanted. And 
you. Plate mail takes up too damn much space. That's the one problem with it. Okay. Sort everything. Like so. Try to maximize my area because I never remember to actually take things to town. Personal flaw. There. All right. Weird that. Go to the next room. Also, let's actually cure fear. What's in here? Oh, pfft. you're hardly even worth paying attention to. You're definitely not worth paying attention to. All right. Let's go ahead and throw up a power cure. That's a very nice bow. That is being equipped right now. I have desperately needed something like that. Okay, so first off, what ring am I removing? 10 might and personality, resist paralysis, accuracy 12, personality 7, personality 6. Let's remove personality 6 and add that. Is this... Yeah, so in might magic 7 and 8, it'll actually tell you the effective increase in body magic. But now that effectively gave me plus 6 body magic. I've been looking for those types of items. The only one that I had found so far was the one that was of um, earth magic, which is useless to me. I'm just gonna hold on to this for a bit. Actually, this way is probably better for me to go for now. So this just takes me to the exit, right? Yeah. I just wanted to make sure I had the exit clear. Hi. <laughs> Fools. Yeah, I know there's one in the corner. Even a good one in the corner. Keep that dropped for now. Locked, locked. I still don't know who the big guy is in this case. Who's a big boy? You're a big boy, Ed. Yes, you are. All right. That's at least small. That's enchantable. Uh -huh. That's still enchantable, and I can't fit it, can I? I'm going to have to come back here. All right. Yeah, so let's go ahead and... Um, right, I need to distribute this bow because that bow is way better than any other bow that I have. It's going on you. Let's beacon here. Set. Tam portal, new serpical. Immediately run over and start selling. Yeah, you mostly have armor. Sweet. 
so much money. That's actually really nice armor too, but it pales in comparison to what I currently have. Sell, sell, enchant. Sell. Honestly, let's sell those at this point. I'm not going to use them. Sell. Sell. All right, let's check. Helm check. I think that's going to be better than the Doom one. For her. Yeah, that's way better. I'm trying to do this as fast as possible because I have a very, very low amount of water magic. <laughs> I have no idea what my housemate's playing. All right, sell all these things. Oops. Beacon, you call Warlord's Fortress. Ah, uh, things that are on the ground have disappeared. That's not normal. Also, I got a request to make sure that Torchlight was up. That's not something I normally pay attention to because my monitor is really bright. How am I doing on haste? It's time for a recast. Hi. That was nice damage. Remove your fear. Fire your ball. Die. I mean green. So many things that I need the correct key for. Yes. That's cell bait. That's not even enchantable. Uh -huh. Where's that? Okay, let's actually go get the right key, shall we? Uh -huh. Garbage, 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 garbage. Actually, halfway decent belt. All right, but there was no key in here. What the heck? White liquid, yellow, blue. White, yellow, blue. White. Already forgotten who needs accuracy. You need accuracy. Yellow, blue. Empty, empty, empty. Blue, yellow. Blue, yellow, 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 green, blue, yellow. And who needs endurance? 96, 80. Yeah, let's just get you to 100. I think that's what I was doing before, at least. So why can I not pick the locks of the rest? Well, obviously there's still a hidden room because otherwise I should be able to see where those blue things are. I'm gonna guess. Yeah. I guessed correctly, yay. That's an item at least. Compared to everything else here, this is kind of weak. with the cannot pick the lock. I don't remember it now. Uh -huh. That's enchantable. You're going to find space for that. Because that's garbage. Oh, help. That's cell bait. Oh, be useful. That could actually be useful. Ah. Haste potion, telekinesis scroll. Alright. Mo Mo 
money. I am rich. Yes, that is enchant bait. So much money. Hey, that's all bait. That's actually nice. Enchant bait. That's for distribution. That's sell. Okay. I have got to know what is up with the I cannot pick this lock. Let me go look this up really fast. Because this is going to bother me. What is it with those? <laughs> what was it? It was something dumb, I want to say. <laughs> oh, looks like it's a bug. Huh, I wonder if it's a bug that's um, from unofficial patches. Yeah, I no longer have the keys in my inventory, so I guess I'm not getting that loot. Okay, it's not a big deal. What's your belt? Might 22, speed 7, endurance 9, luck 14. That'll do. Um, might plus 14. Really, I don't need the resistance paralysis at this point. That shoes of increased recovery, which would be really nice. Because it means I can use an axe other than that one. You do have really nice boots, to be fair. You have increased recovery. So really, yeah, let's just give that to him. Then I can use a different axe later on. At least the next time I find an axe to enchant. Okay, so that clears out this dungeon. We have defeated the warlord and all of his minions. So something I was reading is that these chests are all linked together and they may not actually be in the base game. I'm not sure. Hmm. That's gonna bother me a bit. Oh well. Um, Let's TP out of here and sell some stuff. Also enchanting things. Don't touch the merchant. It's sad to get rid of those boots. I really like them. That was a regular true cross spell, wasn't it? Dang it me. I meant to enchant that. It just didn't fit in his inventory. This is what I get for going too fast. Oh well. Let's yes. let's just start a chanting. Um, because the seeing eye is gonna close first, I'm gonna enchant that stuff first, which is magic items. So that's probably a keep. Sell, 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 sell. Antique is going to be sell. Spell points plus nine. 
Yeah, let's get rid of the hit point increase. Yeah, it's low enough hit point increase where I'm not too concerned. And let's sell some stuff. Okay. Move back over to whip ons. Right, that's cell bait. Um, how am I doing on crossbows? Yeah, I've got better bows than this. Sell, sell, sell. That goes to you. You still don't have enough space. You do, actually. I just need to reorganize. There. Um, that's going to be sold. Nothing else in your inventory sells. Eh, let's go ahead and get rid of some of these. I'm going to keep the scroll of remove paralysis and get rid of awaken as well. Because honestly, sleep isn't that bad of a status effect. Um, right, I had scroll stuff, which means I need to go over here. Actually, I'm curious about something. So, the gener uh, general store merchant is open longer and later, but usually... Oh, okay, I do sell at cost. Uh, usually it's harder to sell at cost to these people. Apparently not in this case. Well, that would have saved me a lot more time earlier. Go ahead and sell. Yep. All right. We have sold everything off. We are quite a bit richer. Uh, how are we doing on experience? 44. Also, he is a lot lower on XP than the rest because of the order that I ended up doing the, uh, whatchamacallit, um, learning skill. But there we have it. Um... Five minutes remaining. Good timing. Let's go ahead and fly up heel and stop for the night. It's 9-11. I could do one more video. Let's go ahead. Oh, first off, let's make a real save. Uh, so we can stop by... Sir Osric Temper's place to go turn in that quest. I'm not going to do that at the moment. I'll do that next video. Oh, right at about an hour or two. I hope you've enjoyed this video, Internet, and I will talk to you next time, which will probably be, for me, immediately after I move this video over to my hard drives. Good night.